hi. I have to start those new vlogs to give up my old vlog <laughs> because we've had technical difficulties and it won't upload. So I'll have to sort out today. Hopefully that should be up today. Um, tomorrow is my birthday. So yesterday my family were up, uh, the weekend my family were up. My mom made me open this present early. My mom got me a Pandora bracelet. It has 21 on it and the clasp of the bracelet is a family tree and it says family on the back. I've not really done a good job showing you that, but yeah. We are now on our way to the iron clinic, as always. It's my last iron clinic being 20. I'm dressed very 90s today. I, I actually love these mum jeans. I got these mum jeans from Primark. I got them in this colour and a lighter colour, and I've worn the hell out of them. They're my favourite. I feel really comfortable in them. They're like, they're just so comfy, and um, it makes me confident to wear my crop tops because they're nice and high waisted, so you can't see my chubber. So I'm in a Minova and I've almost had the worst day of my life today because I'll tell you. So I was on my laptop trying to do some this stuff and I couldn't find my most recent draft and I searched through all my drafts and it wasn't there and then it like I was like oh my god I've just lost like 2,000 over 2,000 words of my dissertation and like 20 odd references and so I was like freaking out and I had a, I had a small cry and I was like this close to just calling it quits in life. Um, and then I went back on my laptop and I click, 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 and by a miracle, I'm telling you, by Jesus Christ himself, it came back on my laptop. So the drama was over and it's okay now. So I'm feeling okay. But it was almost the worst last day of being 20 ever. So yeah, I'm going to carry on and just need to tell you that. Need to give you an update. So yeah. Good morning. It is my birthday. I woke up this morning to this in my face. I was sent to bed early last night, so I have lots of energy this morning. So, I know I was sent to bed on the night before my 21st birthday by my boyfriend and my housemates. That's rude. I was gonna say, he's got stuff planned for me today. But I don't know what. And he gets up until two in the morning prepping, so. And now we're waiting up and it's only 8 o'clock. Okay, so I've had oh. two mimosas. It is like 9. I've had two mimosas. We are watching Spirited Away. I've had breakfast. He made me uh, uh, basically a knockoff McDonald's breakfast and it was delicious. So now I'm going to open some presents. But yeah, George sent me this. George is in Thailand and he, I know he watches the vlog, so hi George. Uh, George is in Thailand and he got me this. So I'm going to open it now. Ew. They always put the big boxes, not really things. Okay. Wait, okay, so this is what it looks like. I'm scared. To Jade, hope you have the great birthday and happy vlogging from George. What's that smell? I miss George, ma'am. Get in my feelings. Okay, it's more plastic. Okay. <laughs> I'll be back. Uh. I'm so stupid. Why the fuck am I crying? tripod and I don't know what this is it says video phone video kit oh my god oh my gosh yo vlog's about to take a real good turn thank you George I'll message him now my mate George who bought me this has a academy a football academy he's currently in Thailand as I said but I'm pretty sure we'll be doing here. I'm pretty sure we'll be doing it again when he comes back. So I'll, I'll link him. I'll put, I'll put his Instagram for his football academy in my description in case you want to hit him up. Give it a follow. Support him because he has supported the vlog.
Ooh, they look funny. My mom and Nan are the same people. <laughs> Incredible. I am so happy, so hope you have the best 21st birthday. You're so old from Zenden. <laughs> and then you wrote, Yahoo! <laughs> that is so sweet! Oh, how does one know? I think you just ran out of this. Nice. Happy birthday to you! <laughs> happy birthday to you! Oh, you. Oh, you. Happy birthday, DJ! Happy birthday to you! <laughs> yeah, so basically, um, it's the next morning. I had a really good birthday. Uh, I had some mates round and it was really nice. Um, but towards the evening, my back started playing up. I don't know if I've mentioned it before, but I hurt my back. But, like by laying weird a couple a couple weeks ago about a week ago and it, now it's like in my leg um, i'm just dealing with it now so yeah i went to bed really early last night like half past 10 because my back was playing up so 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 bad like i had to have oscar like was like rubbing um some ibuprofen gel into it and he tried to like crack it because it feels like it needs to be cracked but yeah and then i woke up today and it's still pretty bad so I've called in sick for tutoring because there's not a chance I'd be able to walk because I have to walk there. It's quite, it's not far far, it's like a 20 minute walk. Um, and walking up and down the stairs or walking to the toilet is hard enough. So I've called in sick. Um, if it was just my back, I think I'd be all right. But because it's gone into my leg and it's like in my thigh and in my shit and I'm like, like when I walk, it, it hurts and I'm making like dad noises. Um, I didn't say in the, like I just was editing. The little photo frame was from Charlotte and I got loads of other gifts so if you did send me a gift or a card or anything like that or even a message thank you so much for the birthday uh, stuff um, I'm really grateful thank you it is Thursday and I'm going out for the first time since Monday I'm gonna go to a tutor meet at a, a dissertation meeting to talk about my draft uh, and then to the labs to pick up some more information and then to tutoring um, and then back home, or maybe shopping, I'm not sure yet. Kind of want to treat myself to shopping. Hi, baby! So, yeah, we'll see. So, <laughs> I'm like a mess because my meeting with my supervisor, but I'm not sure. Um, he gave me a lot of advice, slags me a little bit. I look like a mess. Uh, but my mentoring has been cancelled. I'm trying my best to keep my life together. <sighs> Alright. Just written down all the bits and... Well, just photos of all the bits and pieces and shit that I need. Um, it's just... It's just doing my time. It turns out I've got a lot more than I originally thought that I have to do to do. And I go back to work this weekend, so... How? On way home now, I did some retail therapy, got some bits from, I went in all the charity shops on the high street and every time I go in there, it's very hit or miss. Um, I've been really into buying vintage uh, slash second hand hound, hand pieces recently. Um, so I got a shirt from a second hand shop, or a charity shop, what I'm going to say. Uh, it's only from Primark. And that's why I bought it. I bought it because last year I saw it and I thought, oh, yes. But I was broke last year, like really broke last year. Because um, I didn't have a job and um, I didn't have a job and the bank, something happened with my overdraft, which meant they removed a grand and a half of it. Well, grand, a grand and one, uh, 1100. And so I had to pay off my overdraft which meant I had literally no money last year. 
Um, so I couldn't buy it from Primark. And then I just went, went to the charity shop and I saw it and I was like, well, I'm buying it. It was three pounds. But I also bought a shit ton from Primark and some, some things from Anne Summers. Oh, yeah. I feel cute. Oh. Oh, yeah. I'll show you what else I got. Okay, so let me show you also got. So I've got these. I really, really like them. I think they're really, really cute. Um, some mum shorts. Yeah. One of these. Because that shirt that I got, remember that shirt um, that I got from the vintage store? It's back to front. It's, it needs something underneath it. So I got this to wear underneath it. Uh, and then I got this shirt. I thought that would look cute with this outfit I've got on right now. Um, some little socks, which is, I like these socks, I'm literally wearing them right now. And then the last thing I got was a new bomber jacket, because it was £3 from the men's section. Then I found this, which is a Primark shirt, I know, and summer bits. And I know that those people are not up for showing their dildos and shit. I'm going to be open with you, my family already know, so what I've got to lose. And so I went to Ann Summers and I thought, I'm going to treat myself. So I got myself, if you don't like this, skip it, I don't care. Um, I bought two things and they wrap them in this so no one can look inside your bag and see that you've got like a big dildo or something in there. Um, I'm, not, I'm not ashamed. I bought this. I sort of pressed into this one because um, I went in. I went. In, I went in originally to get some bras. I want bras. I want more bras that haven't got any padding to them. I'm wearing one right now because they're so comfy. So I'll try and find some of them. And then I found myself looking at sex toys, and then I bought two sex toys. So yeah. So and Summers had a two a buy one get one half price offer, and I didn't. I wasn't going to get it. But then I was looking. So I was just having a look under my brows, and for ages, me and Oscar have been talking about buying. Uh, they're called love eggs. Um, I like the idea of it, it's one of my kinks. Um, so we are talking about it for a while and then I got one. Oh my gosh. Well you can't see it, but it's called the Anselmo's Fusion uh, Remote Egg. So basically, it looks like this and this is the egg and this is the remote. Alright, and then I got this one because I got pressure into it. She was like, oh, two for two. It's buy one, get one half. Oh, I sat on my nose, deal. Buy one, get one half price. And I was like, no, it's alright. I can't find anything that I want. But I was eyeing this up for a while. I was like, looking at it and I was like, no, I shouldn't. I shouldn't. I shouldn't. And then I did. She was like, are you sure this shelf? And I was like, oh, you know what is there? And it's fake. Like it was, I saw it like six times in the store, in the store, sorry. And I was like, no, you can't, no, no. And then when it was right by the uh, tail, I was like, well, God wants me to. <laughs> Good morning. I am wearing my dungarees today with my new Primark shirt. And I got a face mask and nose strip on and put on my EOS. I'm not planning to do much today, but my dissertation. And obviously, if my dissertation's on, I might obviously have to be watching something. So I should have something on in the background. <sighs> um, to avoid dying of boredom. So, face mask, no strip, walking dead dissertation. Yeah, where's that one? I just got back a coursework mark and I was really 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 worried about this coursework mark because I was doing it while doing my dissertation lab and I'm not gonna lie to you I didn't really read through it before I submitted it I was just like all right that's done I'm not I'm not reading back through it so off you pop and a girl got 88% in it I'm literally so bad at ending the vlogs I'm, I'm sat really awkwardly because when I sit normally you can't it's really bad lighting um but yeah I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a like. I don't really say that, but yeah, give it a like, and I'll see you in the next video.
Zeichen.